welcome. It is officially Halloween season and I have decided that I'm going to do 13 days of Halloween vlogs. I'm not going to be doing everyday vlogging. I'm only going to be doing 13 days of vlogging as you could have guessed from the name. So maybe I'll do like every other day but we'll see how it's feeling. I'm still interested in doing vlogmas but that is a ways away and I want to be able to enjoy the Halloween season because I have a lot of fun things planned and I wanted to bring you along with me. Ugh. Oh my gosh, I'm not enjoying this coffee at all. <laughs> By the way, check out this skeleton mug. I think I showed it in my last vlog, but I didn't like mention it. But I did buy this little mason jar that is a skull at Home Goods in like July. And I have been using it for my coffee ever since and I love it. But I did get, a, this actually also might have been in a vlog, I got pumpkin spice decaf coffee K-cups and I am not enjoying them at all. I actually do really enjoy pumpkin spice. Ryan is a way bigger fan of pumpkin spice than me, but I, I still enjoy it. And I wanted it for, you know, fall season because I was just feeling all the fall vibes. And uh, this one in particular is not good at all. <laughs> I also have creamer in here, as you tell, it's very light, but I don't think that helped at all. I did start using creamer with this because almond milk just did not cover up the flavor enough. I'm trying to power through because I don't want to throw out the pumpkin K-cups, but I will say this whole ordeal has taught me that I do not like light roast coffee. It's so funny because every time I talk, especially in vlogs, about how I prefer to drink coffee black, I feel like people are always like, oh, she's such a coffee snob. Like she thinks she's so cool because she drinks black coffee. I gotta tell you, it is a different situation. When you are drinking dark roast coffee black, it tastes sweet and delicious and rich, but light roast coffee like if this I, I don't know if you guys are thinking that i'm drinking light roast coffee black but i that is not palatable for me it is incredibly bitter don't think that of me i enjoy my dark roasts i think they're like delicious and sweet and rich and this is just like super bitter so uh not a huge fan but anyway that is neither here nor there by the way i do also have laundry going so don't mind the noise but yeah so we are kicking off the 13 days of halloween and i have have some exciting things that I bought. I actually went shopping yesterday with Leah to a bunch of the home decor stores, which I did vlog, which I'll, I'll insert the footage in a minute, but we were originally gonna go today and then she had something come up for today. So we went yesterday and we tried to buy a bunch of Halloween decor, but before I set that up, I do need to clean the house. My brother and my sister-in-law are gonna come see the house in a couple of days and we still haven't fully unpacked. Act. So I kind of want to get a lot of that stuff done. That's why I'm I'm like, I wanted to get all cutesy and Halloween for the vlog, but I'm not doing that yet. I'll do it after I'm done cleaning because I have a feeling I'm going to get a little sweaty from that. So yeah, the plan is to clean up. I also want to unbox the first day of my advent calendar and then wear it. <laughs> so that'll be also the plan for today. But I do want to like start the cleaning process. I'm going to be doing more cleaning tomorrow, but I will also get give you a little haul of everything that I bought yesterday, but let me insert the footage from yesterday. We went to a couple of different home decor stores and we bought a bunch of Halloween stuff. So roll that footage. Hello, coming to you from the guest bedroom. Well, it's also my office, but there's a bed in here. So I'm just sitting on the bed. Don't mind my stuffed animals. Today I am going Halloween decor shopping with Leah. I believe we're going to hit the trifecta today. We're going to go to at home, home goods, and then potentially Target. So we'll see how we're feeling. I'm super excited. This is the first year that I'm going to be able to buy outdoor decor, but I don't know how like intense I want to get with it. I have some stuff from the last few years, but we are in a bigger place now and then I also have outdoor decor space so I don't know how much I want to do outside but I think I'm just gonna go based on the vibes of the stores so very excited I'm wearing some Halloweeny type decor let me put you down somewhere so I can show you <laughs> this is an awkward spot I don't have a, a cute spot to show you guys where my outfits are but I, I will work on it don't worry but I, I have a lot of Halloween themed outfits so this is what I'm wearing today there's a little deodorant mark that I just noticed on my shirt but I'm about to go wipe that off but I have this shirt that says spooky this is actually like flash reactive I also have these leggings that have this crazy little pentagram cut out that I always bring out for Halloween time and then I'll show you the boots once I put them on but once Leah gets here we are going to 
pop that on. But anyway, back to where we were. <laughs> Leah is on her way to pick me up. I'm still not comfortable driving yet. I've been cleared to drive. I'm cleared to do everything now with my eye situation, but I, I just feel like I'm not ready yet. But the good news is my eyes are healing very well. So I'll, I'll probably update you more on that tomorrow just because this is just the, the shopping portion of the vlog. I'm gonna do like a full daily vlog tomorrow, which is probably what you're watching right now. Just you know, the sun is still very bright, so I'd rather just not have to worry about it. And Leah was loving enough to offer to drive, so she's taking care of me today. But yeah, I will bring you along on the adventure, so let's go. By the way, here are the boots. They're like astronaut boots. They say remove before takeoff and they're orange on the inside. And I do not remember where any of this outfit is from because this is all like at least four years old at this point, but gotta break it out every Halloween. We made an impromptu stop at Burger King. I did not get anything. The guy offered us crowns, unprompted. We did not say anything, but now we have crowns. <laughs> Burger King's baby. We are here. <laughs> Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> we are here. <laughs> sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Should I get this for my front yard? <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. I love that there's like different themes, you know? Harvest vibes, but I'm really, I'm gonna focus on scary so vibes. Can you stop making bodily functions while I'm vlogging? <laughs> Come on. We have found the section. Are you ready for this? This is the section. Purple Halloween decor. This is it. Do I want to get a bunch of potion <laughs> bottles? Oh my gosh, that is Leah coughing in the background, by the way. Uh, it is way too early for Christmas stuff right now. I want to be, Leah's very excited about no, these. No, I mean, I'm like, I'm, I am excited about these because I think they're very cool <laughs> and I'd like to make one, but what the heck, guys? I don't know what's up with this. Although it is getting me excited. We did find some fun skull stuff. This is a this is a potential, but it's very similar to what I have. This is like quality. This feels good. So I, I might get one of these, but I don't know what color I would get. This one's multi-chromatic. Oh, this one doesn't feel as nice. Should I get this? Maybe I just or maybe I'm gonna send it. For size reference. Should I get this? You know what's even taller? Look at this stack of pumpkins. We gotta go look at that from the other side. Oh, you know who it looked like when it was like inside? Ryan. I was gonna say Lord Farquaad. I actually almost screwed that one. <laughs> okay, look at this. How cute is that? I love this. I want one in like just black and white maybe or just orange. Ooh, this one's cute. Ah, <gasps> this one changes colors. Ooh, wait, look at this one. Ooh, that one's like spooky stars and stuff. Just regular stars. But it's, it's scary, yeah, for sure. Ooh. We're going on to home goods now. Oh my gosh, look at these little oh, pumpkin so pastas. This is so cute. Uh, we might be too late for Halloween stuff because they only have like a tiny little end cap of Halloween things. So yeah, that was yesterday. I'll show you all the stuff that I bought in a minute. We didn't end up going to Target and I was really disappointed in that Home Goods run because they had almost nothing. I'm probably going to run to a different Home Goods at some point this week just to see if they have any more stuff because I didn't get too much. I do have a whole house to fill now, but I also have some stuff from last year and years prior. So I'll show you that stuff too, just so you get a feel for what I'm gonna be decorating with. But like I said, I do wanna clean. I want to, unpack the little remainders that are just hanging around and then I also want to mop and tidy and all that stuff just to you know start to get it ready for when my brother comes and sees it and then I think later tonight we're going to grab dinner with some friends and then I think we're gonna go to bingo which I probably <laughs> will not be vlogging but I'll show you if I can let me show you what I bought is it too loud in here maybe I should go upstairs is this a weird spot I don't know we're in the dining room which is just a table. And then also I have some of my crystals here. I don't know, this is a room that we do not use. So maybe I'll just 
do my haul in here. Here's all the stuff that I got. It's not all at home. I just popped the home goods stuff in here too, but I'll go through it. I don't know why being in here is like cracking me up. <laughs> Whatever. Maybe I'll, it'll be inspiration to make it cute. I don't know. I gotta think about it. But it's a nice clean slate right now. I guess I'll show you the home goods stuff first because it's on the top of the bag, but they really did not have Halloween themed things. So I ended up getting some stuff that was just like regular, but I can make it Halloween themed. The first of which is these two candlesticks. I just thought they were cute and I figured you know what would be really cool is if I got some of those bleeding candles where they look white but then when you light them they look red so I should have gotten those those were at at home so I ended up finding these orange candles and I figure I don't know if I'm gonna light them because it's very clear that they are white on the inside but at least it'll be like cute in the candlesticks and then I also figure we can use these other times of the year I also grabbed this this honey pumpkin candle because I like pumpkin scented candles and I thought this one smelled so good. Leah was disgusted by the smell of this candle. But also look at the little ombre, how cute is that? So got that. I will say Home Goods is good for candles. I, I mean, it's also good for everything else, but apparently it is not good for Halloween. The cashier told us that they had their Halloween stuff out in July and it was all gone by August. So this was just the scraps. But yeah, I got another pumpkin candle. This is pumpkin waffles. Ugh, this one smells so good. I really thought Ryan was gonna love this one, but he seemed indifferent, but we'll see once I light it. And then the last thing I got was this. This is just like that fake, I don't know, is it called? pompous grass or something. I just thought this was so cute. It feels very fall and I feel like I could just leave it out for a while or I was thinking I might swap out the eucalyptus that I have in my film background for this for like October, November. That would be kind of cute. I don't know. I got a bunch of stuff from at home. I got some outdoor decor. Ryan has requested that I not share the outdoor decor just so that people cannot find our house based on the decor. So I'm not going to show you that but I'll show you the indoor decor that I got. So I did get a bunch of these these. This was the little potion bottles that they have and they are, it's hard to tell in this lighting, but they are multi-chromatic. This one says moon dust. It is multi-chromatic, has a little witch hat on the top. This one says coffin juice on it. It's got a little skull on the top. Again, very multi-chromatic, cute. I got this really big one. This is like a wine bottle and it says wing of bat, which I thought was cute. And it has a little bat on the top. I feel like I could, <gasps> nope, I can't. <laughs> Just broke it. It's fine. I was gonna say I could actually put something in here, but it is glued in So I just ripped the little bag topper off So I'm gonna have to probably glue him back on but I just thought these were all so cute And then I also just grabbed a black pillar candle just because I figured I don't know I could throw that somewhere and I got this potpourri. It's like Halloween themed. So there's like ghosts and little haunted houses and pumpkins and stuff. I was gonna buy a little wooden bowl, but I could not find just like a simple black bowl or a simple light wood bowl, which would be the colors that match in like our kitchen living room area. So gotta find something for that. And then the last thing I got was this mug, which is very similar to the glass that I was just drinking out of, but this one has a little handle and it's also like a deeper color. So it's like a I don't know, like a almost bluish tone to it. So I, I like that. But yeah, so that is everything that I got so far, which is not much, but I do have a bunch of stuff. I guess I'll show you that after I start to do some cleaning and organizing, when I actually like pull it out and start putting it everywhere, I'll show you the other stuff that I have. So yeah, I'm gonna drink my awful coffee. I'm gonna do some cleaning and then I'll catch up with you in a bit. Hello, it's been a couple of hours. I've just been cleaning, unpacking, organizing. I didn't show it just because I feel like like it'll take twice as long if I need to like set up a camera and vlog it, but I'm just trying to, you know, get stuff done. But I really wanted during my 13 days of Halloween to unbox my haunted house advent calendar with Orly. So I thought it could be fun if each day of the 13 days of Halloween, we unbox it and then I can wear whatever's in it. I know it's in everything. <laughs> I don't know why I'm acting like it's a surprise. I also, opened all of them in this. I don't know if you can tell on camera. Maybe I shouldn't have even said it. No, I think you can tell. <laughs> but yeah, I figure we could unbox it and then I could wear the things that are wearable and it'll be just a fun way to wear all of the colors. So yeah, 
that's that's what I'm gonna do right now. I am actually wearing, my nails look pretty rough because I've just been cleaning, but I'm wearing Starly Blood Belly Jelly in a jelly sandwich with crunchy leaves. I'm not gonna show you too close right now, but you can see, I'm gonna do like a little short on YouTube on my main channel so that you can see like what it looks like. It's very pretty, but I wanna wear whatever's in day number one, which I already know what it is. <laughs> so let's unbox it together. We've got day number one here. We open it up and it's Gumbatty. So this is a gold holographic bat glitter topper. So I wanna wear this today, I'm very excited. I'm trying to decide what I wanna wear it over because it is a topper. You can pretty much wear it. If you sponge it on, you can wear it as a full coverage, but I'm trying to decide if I want to wear it over an orange cream or if I wanna wear it over purple. I will take off this manicure and then I will pop this on. I'll show you what it looks like and I'll, I'll do a little reel as well. I've been really enjoying doing these little mini reels on YouTube just to show you guys my manicures that I wear and it's nice to be able to show you in like natural lighting just so you can see the color and like the sun and the shade so that's been really fun but yeah as you can see still haven't gotten dressed or anything oh wait I actually also want to show you before I start using it hello it's been a couple of hours. <laughs> so my camera died and then I did not have a spare battery, so I had to charge it. But I ended up doing my nails. So I did Gone Batty and I wore it over Don't Sweet It by Orly, which is one of their breathables. I was gonna do Synthetic Symphony, but I feel like I've just been wearing that so much lately. And I actually noticed when I was looking at Synthetic Symphony that Don't Sweet It actually kind of matches the bat that's on the Gone Batty <laughs> polish. So I don't know, I thought it would be a cute combo and I did it and I really like it. So yeah, that's done. But what I was going to show you as my camera was dying is that I bought these organizers. I don't know how much I even said before the camera died, but I mentioned in a recent vlog that I went to the container store because I wanted to get some under cabinet storage in my bathroom over here. Everything was so expensive over there. So I just ordered something on Amazon, which looking at it now, it's a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be. By the way, I also put this up last week, which is just like this little faux brick wall that's also sound dampening. So I thought that was cute. You don't see it in my videos, but it's like, it's next to, here's like where my tripod is and stuff. I'm not gonna move it just because I don't wanna mess it up. So this is a set of four and it's this size drawer. I mean, this is cute, but I, I don't know how much this is going to be able to organize, but I am going to use these. It also came with, oh, cute. It came with little, little thingies that you can put on the bottom so that they don't slide around, which is convenient. But yeah, let me see how much I can even fit in here. I have a lot of like full size care products that I wanted to store. I don't know. I have another drawer thingy as well. So maybe I can use that. I don't know. I'll mess around with it a bit. And then it's actually getting pretty late. So I probably, need to start getting ready soon to go to dinner and hang out with our friends but I'm gonna do just a little bit of organizing in the meantime. I probably shouldn't show this to you because <laughs> it's kind of wild but I have so much products that I don't know if they're gonna fit. So here's my just array of products <laughs> that I need to organize. So we'll see how this goes. Okay, I gotta say, that ended up fitting a lot more than I expected. Let me show you. So this is now my sink. It's nice and empty. Don't mind the towels being a mess and I still haven't put up the shower curtain. Still things I need to do. But in here, I have all of my stuff nicely organized now. So it doesn't look cute, but I mean, the, the acrylic containers are nice. My other container is not that nice. It does the job, so I'm happy. <laughs> Hello friends, it is many hours later and I am finally dressed and ready for the day which is now the night. I don't know if you can see my outfit. I need a full length mirror, but I'm just wearing some high-waisted shorts and then I have a little crop top and then I'm wearing this cropped hoodie that I got from Amazon and it's got bones on the arms and it's actually flash reactive and I have matching flash reactive boots. So here's what it looks like. It's literally the same color and when it has like a flash on it, it looks like silvery white and it's actually the same brand as the ones I wore yesterday, but I don't know what brand it is because it does not say. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to show any of Bingo or if I'm going to update you tonight, but I'll try to sneak some footage. Fabulous. 
sweating my face. Hello everybody, it is the next day. I am about to head to the grocery store and just pick up some like small things for when my brother and my sister-in-law come over tomorrow just in case they're feeling snacky. We don't have too much food in the house right now. So I, I just wanna be prepared. I also wanted to tell you about last night. We ended up doing bingo, which I'm gonna be honest, I did not realize that that was a gambling thing, which sounds kind of silly now that I say it because it was at a casino, but I thought it was gonna be like maybe pay $10 and you can like stamp a bingo card, but it was really expensive and also you didn't do anything. They just gave you like an iPad and then everything was automatic. So we basically just sat there for an hour and like watched our bingo cards and didn't get bingo. Not something I would recommend or do again. <laughs> and definitely the most money I have ever spent gambling. But anyway, yeah, so I'm going to run to the grocery store and then I'm just gonna continue tidying up and whatnot. So yeah, hello. I am back from grocery shopping. I just picked up like a couple of things just in case my brother and my sister-in-law are in the mood to snack when they come visit. By the way, really quick, I did take off the manicure this morning from last night because I thought that today was gonna be like another day of the 13 days. I forgot I didn't finish the vlog last night. So I'm gonna paint them tomorrow. So we'll see what's in day number two. I already know what it is, but We'll see. Not too much stuff, but I'll show you what I got. I did get a couple of bags of stuff. I got pretzel sticks and I got popcorn. This is not for them, but I did buy a little bowl for our Halloween candy because I was trying to buy one of these at Home Goods and they did not have any. So I just picked one up. I got some strawberries, some grapes. These little mini croissants were on sale and I really like them, so I grabbed some. And then I also got this little mini pack of pumpkin chocolate chip cookies. And then I also got this, it's key lime pie flavored sparkling water or seltzer. I don't actually know what the difference is. I'm actually super annoyed about this because I wanted it last week and I didn't want to buy it because I was like, ooh, I don't know if I'm gonna like the flavor. And I feel like it's usually cheaper to buy stuff at Target. It was $3.99 last week and now it's on sale, but it's $4.99. So I'm, I'm actually really annoyed about that. But yeah, grabbed it anyway because I want to be fully stocked with drinks. So yeah, I'm gonna put this away. Clearly I have not cleaned the kitchen yet. I don't know if you can tell that it's there's like crumbs and stuff but we are gonna cook dinner first and then we're going to organize it and clean it nicely so i think i'm gonna end the vlog here but hopefully this was an enjoyable first day of 13 days of halloween i think tomorrow i'm gonna do like all of my decorating and stuff and then we're probably gonna do some running around on the strip so we'll see if there's anything fun going on over there so i will bring you along for that and yeah if you're not already subscribed please consider subscribing i'll see you guys next time and i love you bye <laughs>